Excellency Michel Temer, President of the Federative Republic of Brazil, Heads of State and Government of the Common Market of the South and Associate States, Ministers of Foreign Affairs, Heads of Delegations, Members of the Diplomatic Corps, Ladies and Gentlemen. The Delegation of the Cooperative Republic of Guyana is delighted to be in Brasilia. We thank His Excellency President Michel Temer and the Government of the Federative Republic of Brazil for the warm welcome and the excellent arrangements put in place to facilitate our participation in the 51st Summit of Heads of State of Mercosur and Associated States. We congratulate President Temer on his stewardship of the organization over the past six months. We extend to everyone our best wishes for an enjoyable celebration of the Holy Festival of Christmas. Your Excellencies, common markets flourish in conditions of peace and security. They falter when there is instability and uncertainty. It was not surprising, therefore, that eight years after the signing of its constitutive treaty, the state's parties issued the political declaration of Mercosur, Bolivia, and Chile as a zone of peace. The declaration acknowledged that peace is essential to the continuation and development of the Mercosur integration process. The common market of the South was conceived primarily for economic purposes. The treaty establishing a common market between the Argentine Republic, the Federative Republic of Brazil, the Republic of Paraguay, and the Eastern Republic of Uruguay of 1991 commits the state's parties to establish a common market based on principles of reciprocity. Guyana, here in Brasilia, iterates that aspiration Peace is essential to the continuation and development of the Mercosur integration process. Peace is essential for the economic development and for trade to take place. Peace is a dividend for enhanced competitiveness. Peace must be promoted in Mercosur, its associated states, and throughout the continent. Your Excellencies, the 21st century must be a century of and for the South. The North, the West, and the East have had their centuries. Changes are taking place before our eyes in the United Kingdom, in the United States, and in the European Union. Other regions of the world are sourcing resources and seeking to do business with the South. Negotiations towards a major agreement with Mercosur and the European Union are continuing. An environment of peace and stability, characterized by the absence of interstate and non-state threats, will provide motivation for the consummation and success of these agreements. Guyana is a small state on the northern shoulder of this continent. We have the distinction of being the only English-speaking country in the continent. We are also a founding member and host of the headquarters of the Caribbean community. Guyana has a role to play as a gateway for South America to the markets of the Caribbean, Central America, and North America. We look towards infrastructural cooperation with the countries of the continent to establish highways, railways, and bridges from the south to the north of the continent to enable the movement of goods and people. Guyana's continental destiny is tied to the integration of the continent. Excellencies, the 51st Summit of the Heads of State of the Common Market of the South and Associated States presents another opportunity for this community to reaffirm its commitment to the principles of respect for the inviolability of treaties and other international agreements, respect for the peaceful settlement of disputes and rejection of the use of, or the threat of the use of force as a means of settling disputes. The continent runs the risk of nursing interstate conflicts which can explode and undermine peace unless these principles are held sac sacrosanct. Guyana repeats its invocation for Mercosur to continue its vigilance to safeguard the sovereignty and security of small states on this continent and to eliminate the economic inequalities and political controversies that separate them. This continent must be a zone of peace if all respect 
it is to, if all respect that, it is to prosper. Guyana is a small state with fewer than one million people, seeks cordial relations with all states. We are committed to the principles of mutual respect of each other's territory, mutual non-aggression between states, mutual non-interference in each other's internal affairs, and mutual cooperation for peaceful coexistence among states. Guyana calls attention to the need for regional organizations to take more concerted action to address global warming and climate change, which can harm production and impair trade. The adverse effects of climate change and other natural hazards are degrading the continent's productive assets. Guyana therefore supports the Paris Agreement on Climate Change. We believe that respect for the environment will contribute to greater peace on this continent. In conclusion, Guyana conveys its best wishes to the incoming pro tempore chair of Mercosur, the Republic of Paraguay, in the execution of its mandate over the next six months. I thank you.